man, how is it already version 1.1? Like, it's not here yet, just a trailer for it, but I feel like this game just came out yesterday, you know, or like last week or something, but Thaw of Eons version 1.1 trailer. We know we're going to be going to a very snowy region. Uh, there's a name for it, but I forgot the name. We saw the cinematic for it as well, so we know what this version may be about. So, I wonder how many acts we're going to get. We right back. I can feel the Sentinel's presence inside. But it's not responding. Oh, whoa, whoa, that smile. She was like... Oh, we get to surf? Or is that just sliding like before? I like the maroon color palette. Did he get frozen midair? Oh no! <laughs> This is Mount something. I forgot. This way she poured, and the Sonoro sphere. There she is. There she answer. is. Allow me to demonstrate the proper etiquette. Clear the blaze. Oh, she even got the. Oh man. Beckon the divine flames. Sheesh. Shall we proceed? The storm is coming. Some people must be itching to bounce. Changli. But we both have something we'll fierce. We got two like cracked characters coming out in the spatch. Shine forevermore. Divine moon's blessing. Moment of awakening. Oh, she's so got the Sacred the horns show up. Chin -chi. A fateful clash between the sentinel and myself that would shape the fate of our city. I'm not gonna lie, I think Cheng Li looks a little bit more interesting. Restore the time. From where does this unfounded confidence arise? He once said it's not easy to become a candle of light. But I still want to try. I want to see if I can ignite a spark of hope for Jin Zhou. Ooh. Ooh. What was happening to her? This is with a crack open. Oh, nice. Do puzzles. All right. New, like, entire mechanics with the puzzles, too. Oh, just the way to get around. Reversing time, advancing time. Oh, wait. Oh, that's an echo? Wait. Yeah. Choose an echo? Oh. <laughs> Light crusher. The sword is ridiculous. Eh. Oh, okay. All right. You, you, you saved it. Never mind. If that's like the equivalent to like a mobile one, like the motorcycle dude, Lava Lara. Clang bang. Hmm. All right. Yeah, maybe they should be like multiple. There you go. New weapons, either about their signatures. New events. Exploration event. Areas. Oh, the dream. The dream mode. Hmm. Seven day login. Wait, log into the game and you get that? 
Ain't no way. Okay, t 10 of each. You get 10 standards, 10 limiteds, and 10 forging tides, which is the, the weapon one. Dang. Hey, th thanks for playing our game. Here you go. Like, literally. All right, yeah, I mean, it, on, and it, everything looks promising, if I could speak. Everything looks promising, to be honest. But the story, I hope the story heavily involves, or if, uh, I should say focuses on uh, Jinshi and her backstory and her past. I mean, of course, we'll probably have a little bit of uh, Rover stuff in there as well. Also, I noticed female Rover is like the main pick for trailers and stuff like that. At least I think. I haven't really seen the male tra the ooh, the male rover in um, the trailers. So it seems like the, the female rover is the one that they want to, you know, make canon, so to speak, if you know what I'm saying. Like, of course, you have the option of who you chose, but it looks like through advertisement, they have the female rover. But yeah, Chung, uh, Cheng Li looks really good. Looks, like I said, the more cool kind of character in comparison to Jinshi. But I do wonder if this game will take the lore equals strength approach, where because of the things that she's done and her reputation, that will make her strong in the game. You know what I mean? Like if you're a higher up, you're just kind of naturally strong within the game's mechanics and stuff like that. But then again, you know, plenty of games just have, a, you know, some random dude who works at a cafe is like the strongest in the game or something like that, you know? So you never know. I have noticed with Withering Waves that you can pretty much play as whatever you want for the most part, as long as they do damage I and mean, you'll be fine for the most part. But that is a 1.0 take and we'll see how much things increase over time. But yeah, looking forward to it. Unfortunately, I won't be around day one I'll be, you know, out and about, out of town for a little bit. But once, uh, you know, everything settles with that, you know, come, come back around and definitely check out the story and everything like that. So honestly, yeah, it just looks promising. Looks very promising. So let me know what you guys think about it in the comments. Will you be going for either of these two characters? I don't know what I'll do. I'm actually still working on my own characters in the beginning. So. And it looks like most things will be new here. They didn't mention Weekly Boss, but I'm pretty sure the Weekly Boss is Ju. I'm pretty sure about that. So I imagine that'll be the Weekly Boss for both of them, maybe? We'll see. But that'll be all for me. Hope you guys enjoyed. Catch you guys in the next one.